Hey guys, welcome again to a new content right in the same channel, Celeb Gossip Niger. And please, if you're stopping for the very first time, do hit the subscribe button, hit the bell notification button so you get notified on the daily. And if I tell my long time subscriber, God bless you and thank you so much for the constant love and support. We do so much appreciate you all. Well, in today's video, we're going to be talking about uh, something very sensitive and please want you all to give your thoughts, your reactions or whatever thing you feel just down in the comment section. So we're going to be talking about late prophet TB Joshua and of course, the fact that this particular lady you all are actually watching on the screen right now came up online a couple of days ago and said some really funny things. Well, according to this lady, uh, she had a dream and in that dream of hers it's more like she went to hellfire uh and of course she met prophet tb joshua like tb joshua was there and stuff like that and other pastors so the message she wants to like transmit is that people should be careful they should give their lives to christ they should actually try to make things right with god i know very well that this is a very great initiative this is something very good i mean we all should like know that we have to give our lives to Christ. Like this is something that nobody's supposed to tell you, but it's a plus if someone tells you right. So this lady coming up online, people have actually seen it like a motif, a way for her to like just cruise or something like that. You know, this is something very, very common. Ever since Prophet T.B. Joshua passed on, I mean, we've been getting so many stuff, like so many stories from people, how, or, or, people talking about things he did things he didn't do and stuff like that so at the end we don't even know which one to believe do you guys actually believe that this lady went to like hellfire in her dream and of course saw prophet tb joshua there this is something disturbing because from the best of my knowledge uh tb joshua has been nothing but just kind just a good person so if we are actually saying now that he's in hellfire then what about all his good deeds what about all the things that he did doesn't mean he just went like that he went in vain doesn't mean doesn't mean everything that he did just like vanished he was not compensated in any way so this is something that's really making people to like ponder i for one i'm getting it i'm getting myself walked out because of this because i don't know what to believe or what not to believe so please we're going to dive into this video right now so you get to see uh, or more like listen to what this lady had to say and please tell me right down in the comment section if you by any chance believe what she's saying or if you feel like okay maybe this is just one of those women or one of those people that come up online and of course look for ways to like just uh bring down another person or more like catch crews or something like that right so without further delay without further ado let's just get into the video and of course get everything started let's dive with you guys i have been to hellfire i have felt the pain the torture i don't want to go there and be burnt for everlasting no i don't want to go there i saw the body of tb joshua in hellfire if Dawusa is tormented in hell today because of ring, because of earring, uh, sorry, Adlan, the member to put on others adornment because he himself was put in a long chain. He didn't know. But I'm sorry to tell you that Bishop Idausa is in hellfire. He's crying. Idausa went to hellfire. I saw him. He was tormented in hell. I saw Bishop Idausa in hell. And he was putting long chain. He was wearing the church member with ring. He was also putting ring in his hand. Beloved, you, if you are, if you are a pastor, run away from ring. Don't wear your church member with ring because what I'm telling you is the truth and nothing but the truth. <laughs> 